Hello, this is Laura Matera again, and I'm going to continue looking at ways to show number sense. And we are now moving on to subtraction using number sense strategies. Uh, the big thing we've looked at in the past few videos was making 10 and making friendly numbers. So we're now going to look at that from a subtraction standpoint. The first one is making 10, and that's when we're looking at just subtracting a single digit number. And a lot of our students are still counting backwards, 16, 15, 14, 13, and so on till 8. A more efficient way for them to do that is to think about how much to get to 10 and then how much more to get to 17. So the students can count on to make a 10. They know 8 plus 2 would make the 10. And then they should know by now that 10 and then 7 more makes 17. And so therefore, 17 minus 8 equals 9. The same thing would be true here. Instead of counting backwards from 12 all the way down to 9, they should know that 9 plus 1 more gets to 10, and then 2 more gets to 12, which is 3. And finally, 14 minus 6. They can know to get from 6 to 10 is 4, and 10 and 4 more gets us to 14, so the difference is 8. This same strategy works for larger numbers. Um, it's the same as making 10, except now we're moving on to 20s, 30s, 40s, and the same thing would go when you're getting into numbers with hundreds and thousands. I'm going to model this with a number line, which is a good strategy. Some students get to the point where they can do this in their head, but remember with subtraction, we're finding the difference between two numbers. So we're finding how much is there in between 16 and 40. So we can once again create a number line. And we're starting at 16, and we know we need to get to 40. So once again, we're going to look for landmark numbers. 16 needs four more to get to 20. And then the students might be at the point where they know 20 to 40 is just 20 more, or they might count by tens. 20 to 30 is 10, and 30 to 40 is another 10. So the difference between these two numbers is 10, 20, 24. And the same thing is true here, 50 minus 38. We are finding the difference between 38 and 50. So the first friendly number would be from 38 to 40. We know we added 2 to get from 38 to 40. And then from 40 to 50, we needed to add 10. So the difference is 12. And that's it for subtraction with counting on, making 10, and using our landmark numbers. Thanks again for watching.